We are going to delid a soldered CPU. The way we are going to do this is to first set the beard somewhere safe. We've got our CPU right here. And we are going to use some one-sided razor blades. And then got a pack of 100 for ten dollars. Look for a pack of ten. Didn't find any. Ten bucks. Who knows? What's it matter? So, here's the plan, if I can grab it, you can go over there. We're going to cut into the corners and cut to the sides, not very deep, about two millimeters into here. And you're basically cutting the adhesive that is holding this on. Now on the die, the die it's soldered so that's where we've got to get creative and what we're going to do there is we're going to have one of these in each side and we will have it placed with one of these each side on one of these rolls of tape so You've got this and one on each side, or one in each corner, however we end up doing it. And that's where the iron comes in, in case you're wondering what this is in here. We'll be setting this on here for about a minute to melt that solder and taking it off and when it solder melts it should just fall through and fall straight down there so with that we will get started entering from the corner as flat as possible getting into the corners but we don't want to slice it we don't want to pull it back we don't want to push it forward only rotation here I'm plenty deep I don't want to go any deeper here I can finish the rest from this side entering again from the corner here once again we're going to do the same thing If you at any time feel any kind of resistance, then stop pushing in. Alright, I believe she is cut. So now we're going to get on every side. It'd probably be easier if I go ahead and rotate this.
So at this point in time, we're going to set it in something like this, except this one's a little bit too big, so I'll have to go and see if I've got a little one smaller. So anyways, this will give you, still give you the idea. We will re revisit this in a minute, placing it on that, and then there comes the iron. for about a minute and if all goes well with that hopefully we'll have a deal with its CPU so though I think that's a good idea I've not given up on it I don't think I have quite the good setup for it right now so on this test one we're going to use the tried and true lighter method. So, let's see what we can get here. And it looks like it's in really good shape. So, here's what we got. And you'll saw about how many seconds that took. So here's what we got. Two side by side. And go ahead and
Alright, I believe I'm down to the dot right there. Let's see if I can give y'all a better, better view. You hear how that sounds? It's like glass almost. Now here you can see it's not. And here you'll see that picking up the solder, scraping trying my best to go slow and keep it at a low angle so that I'm not harming anything trying not to scratch the die just trying to get this solder off Here I've got pretty much all the solder off. It has a glass-like feel. I don't really see anything else coming up on it. When I'm scraping, I'm trying to keep my blade at a very low angle and flat. And I believe she's good to go. Now, for this, I can take the razor blade and try to get this off as well along with some alcohol so most of that should peel right off I'll get more majority of this off with a razor blade I can come back with a credit card and some alcohol and clean this up with alcohol and a credit card So we cleaned a little bit off with a fingernail and a little bit off with a razor, a little bit off the guitar pick, or you could use a credit card or something. I've got here, if I can find the camera, a coffee filter with 91% uh, isopropyl alcohol in it, and it's doing a fantastic job. So. It's just going to be a slow process cleaning this off. A little bit easier than the finger now and easier to hold than the credit card you want a fairly stiff guitar pick though so like a .88 somewhere in there any of those be fine .7 or .7 is probably a little thin Point upper 80s up to the ones probably plenty Look at what quick work it made of that.
Okay, so we've got a lot of that off. It's almost like hard glass. There is our finished up D lid.